It's just been such a bad year, 2020, and this has just added to it. There's today's date, Monday the 2nd of November. It's not a very happy day, unfortunately. I come out and I check Barbie the Redback Spider's home every day when it's spider season, and I, uh, I've just come out and done an afternoon check, and I'll just show you what I've found. As always, I'll put that part just under a home there. And today, when I look down inside Barbie's home, I can see the fate-filled egg sacs are there, but unfortunately, Barbie looks like she's passed away. I don't know what's going on down there. It is quite upsetting. Barbie is 11 months old, and she's had a very, very enjoyable 11 months in the spider home here. I will very carefully get her little body out. I have seen a little bit of movement in her, so maybe, maybe she's still got a bit of life in her. But we'll take, we'll take a careful look at her, eh? It's just very sad. I just put it here. There is some movement in it, but I, I don't think she's going to survive. There's something just very seriously wrong with her. There's a bit of web on the tweezers. I'll just have to get the shaker off the tweezers. I've got no idea what's happened to her, but she's not acting normally. There's no way that's normal movement. She looks very sick. It looks like that it'd only be a matter of time before ants found her and, and would devour her. But it's actually very upsetting. She was a fantastic pet spider and I followed her life really all the way through 2020. It's just been such a bad year, 2020, and this has just added to it. I'm just looking back in a spider home. These were the, the fake filled egg sacs I put in here to... to uh, to try and fool her, and it was egg sac 10 and 11 that I took out, and they were in the red back spider tank 3. Like in a strange way, her young do live on for the fact of the spider tank, but I don't know, it's just very upsetting. The whole incident's really upsetting. I'm just making sure if she's got all her legs. I'm pretty sure she's all there, but I'm, I'm just trying to work out what's gone wrong. We've had very, very unseasonally cold weather. It's almost been like winter again. It snapped back to winter. There's been a lot of rain and moisture. I don't know, it's just very strange. And she had a beetle that was only the other day. I watched her eat the beetle and she seemed to accept the fake egg sac. So I just hope those fake egg sacs haven't played into the fate here. It's almost like she's been affected by insecticide, the way she's acting here, but who knows, it could be an environmental issue. She's quite large in the back, she would have, that would have been egg sac number 12, but I'm pretty sure we're not going to get there. But all during 2020, man, she was she was a very, very well, happy spider. She laid up 11 red back spider egg sacs. She had a bit of a break in winter time as they do. And there she is, she's, look, she's putting her legs out, but just, just no life in her. There's no life at all. It's just really, really upsetting. And, and these spiders, they live for about three years, the female redback spiders. And I thought I could have watched this spider for a lot longer, but it's like little sister, you just don't know when their days are up. It, and that's life, isn't it? You just don't know when your final day is. And I'm pretty sure, mark this date on the calendar, it's Barbie's final day. Well, I just had a chat with my son. We were trying to decide what to do with Barbie's little body there, and there's always been ant colonies around Barbie the Redback Spider's home, and maybe the best thing to do is to let the ant colony take Barbie's body. I'll just very carefully pick up her little tiny body. And I'll very gently put Barbie's body in there with the ants, and that way the ant colony can have something to feed on. And it's a reminder that's the way nature works. In nature, nothing is wasted. And the ant colony will succeed from the, the passing of Barbie. Just all the memories and all the videos I made about Barbie. She was just a fantastic spider. But I, I knew this day was going to come. It's like anything, you know, there's going to be a final day. And these things don't last forever. Sometimes... A spider can just disappear in a mystery, just like the way little sister did. But I, I was really hoping to, to follow Barbie for a much, much longer period of time, at least get another year of a life and watch her molt and get a little bit bigger. But we never got there, but 
as always, just remember I've got all of the children in Spider Tank 3 and it's going to be a wonderful thing to watch what happens there. But, uh, yeah, I, I just by chance I came out here this afternoon. I just noticed Barbie wasn't in a web as she normally is and she was balled up in the bottom of her home. And uh, that's the end of her. It's a very, very, very sad day. It's very upsetting. I'll come along and put the lid onto Barbie's home. We'll always remember this spider area here as Barbie's home.